Right, um, Mark, congratulations on Nativity 2. Thank you. Mr Poppy is back. Mr Poppy is back indeed. Um, what can we see from Mr Poppy in this one? What's, what's changed since the end of Nativity? I don't think anything's changed. I think he's still stuck, really, where he was, which is um, he was let down slightly by uh, his friend Mr Madden's um, going off into the distance with the love of his life. And he feels like he needs a relationship with somebody and his children are leaving him as so we meet him at a time where the children are about to go to different schools. So I th and he, they have his, sort of his, his closest friends, which is a bit uh, odd for an adult to have such strong relationships with children. Um, so he wants to form a relationship with another adult and he's given the ultimatum that he needs to make this new teacher work, Mr Peterson, played by the fantastic David Tennant. So he does all he can to make that happen but due to his um, short-sightedness, I suppose, uh, he just ends up irritating him quite a bit. But weirdly, in a zen-like way, he ends up teaching him lots of lessons about life and about believing in yourself and about following your heart. Uh, I'm not sure he's conscious of them, but um, they're there in a spooky, magical way. <laughs> Mr. Poppy's quite unique in that way, that he uh, he frustrates the adult characters around him, at least to start with anyway. But the kids, both in the film and kids in the audience, love Mr. Poppy. Yeah. What do you think that is about him? It's great, isn't it? I love I'm meeting all those children afterwards, and we had the premiere last night, and uh, someone said, oh, he must you know, get annoyed signing things and photographs. And, but I, I really love it because it reminds you that it, the character's connecting to the audience, which is all you ever want to do when you're certainly making a film aimed at this type of age group. You want them to connect with you. And I think it's probably what they connect with is watching an adult uh, be open-hearted and true and fun in a way that adults tend to uh, get quite irritated by little people and uh, the gap sort of widens. And there's no need for it, really. We could all be hanging out like the great apes, just playing with each other. But instead, we get obsessed with paying bills and driving around in metal things and uh, yeah. building things out of concrete and children find it all a bit weird I think when you could just play and would you like to return to Nativity 3 complete the trilogy? I think we're going up to Nativity 24 okay. <laughs> um, where we find that Mr Poppy's in a little old age pension home uh, gently dying <laughs> um, No, I don't know where it's going to stop maybe number 3, who knows? Who knows? I hope so. Really watch this space. Thank and, uh, you. Congratulations on the film and uh, another great Mr. Poppy performance. Ah, thank you very yeah. much. Thanks, Cheers. Mark.